Mueve la cintura, Ezequiel. Eso, así. así. Continuing to unload on Nikolai Butelin, who is fighting back, showing grit, showing heart. I told you guys, he will be able to weather some storms because like a this is, so it's, far. Still, it's an 18 year old punch and he's a grown man at 36. But how much is he going to be able to take and is Jack going to jump in and stop him? Under a minute and a half left in the second, Jack. Now let's see what Boxer have said about the bout Kermel Moten's dominant victory over Nikolai Buzolin electrified the boxing world with reactions flooding in from all corners of the sport. The fight was a masterclass of skill, strategy and sheer athleticism, leaving fans and analysts talking about the young talent. Moten's performance just showed us the influence of his mentor, Floyd Mayweather. Walking out of the ring with a second round TKO win, the conversations among boxing's elite began, reflecting on the fight and Moten's undeniable potential. Let's look into them. Leading the chorus of praise was none other than Floyd Mayweather himself, who was with Moten inside the ring. Known for his careful and detailed approach to boxing, Mayweather has been a guiding force for Moten, instilling in him the lessons and strategies that made him a legend. Speaking to reporters after the fight, Mayweather couldn't hide his pride.
Kermel showed the world what hard work, dedication, and the right mindset can achieve. He was alive and energetic in that ring, and you could see he absorbed everything we've worked on. Tonight, he proved he's ready for the big stage, Mayweather declared. For years, we've seen Mayweather bring up these young fighters, and Moton is a perfect example of a good result. But one voice could not be left behind in all of this. In as much as Floyd has been with Kermel, Gervonta Davis has been on the sides watching everything. Gervonta Davis, a previous close associate of Mayweather and a powerhouse in his own right, also weighed in on Moton's performance. Davis, who has seen Moton's progression up close, was particularly impressed by the young fighter's poise and energy. <laughs> Kermel was on fire tonight. He looked like he was having the time of his life in there. And that's something you can't teach. That's Floyd's influence right there. He stayed sharp, controlled the fight, and never let Buzolin get comfortable. It was a beautiful performance, Davis said. His admiration was evident, and his words highlighted the impact of Mayweather's mentorship. However, it seems that Tank decided to leave his beef behind with Mayweather. But that was not the end of the praise. Ryan Garcia, always quick with his reactions, didn't hesitate to share his thoughts. Garcia, known for his flashy style and quick hands, has had his share of memorable bouts. Reflecting on Moton's win, he said, Kermel was a beast tonight. That energy and skill set were off the charts. You can tell he's got Floyd's touch. Can't wait to see where he goes from here. Garcia's post garnered thousands of likes and comments reflecting the widespread interest in Moton's rise, but he didn't stop there. Ayo, that kid is the better version of Tank. He's gonna be what Tank was never to Floyd. But it doesn't stop here though. Teofimo Lopez, another rising star in the lightweight division, offered his perspective during a live interview. Lopez, known for his explosive style and confident demeanor, recognized the depth of Moton's performance. Kermel put on a show. He dominated from start to finish, and that's the mark of a true champion. The way he moved, the way he threw those punches, you can see he's learned from the best. He's definitely one to watch, Lopez stated. His respect for Moton was clear, adding to the growing anticipation for future matchups. Devin Haney was also not left behind. Often seen as a keen observer of the sport, took a more analytical approach in his comments. Haney, who has been vocal about his ambitions and insights, said, Kermel Moton's win tonight was a masterclass. His energy, his technique, and his ring IQ were all on point. Floyd's influence is all over his style, and it's exciting to see such talent coming up. Haney's tweet resonated with many fans and analysts who appreciate the technical aspects of boxing. Oscar De La Hoya, a legendary figure and promoter, also shared his thoughts on the fight. De La Hoya, who has seen numerous champions rise, provided his seasoned perspective. Kermel Moton's performance was phenomenal. Taking out your opponent that fast is great to be honest. Mayweather did find a good one there. He has the talent and charisma to become a major star in this sport. You can see Floyd's lessons in his style. The defense, the precision, the confidence. Tonight was a big step forward for him, De La Hoya commented. His endorsement carried significant weight, considering his experience and status in the boxing world. Uh, 
At this point, we do know that the kid is going to be under Mayweather for a while now. And what we are witnessing is what people saw with Tank. Mayweather often gets the praise for the young performers. Or to put it like Word in the Street said, Mayweather taking away their shine. But how much is he going to be able to take? And is Jet going to stop, jump in and stop it? Under a minute and a half left in the second. Jet Reese steps in. But it didn't stop here. Bernard Hopkins, known for his longevity and strategic acumen, provided a veteran's insight into Moten's performance. As Hopkins admitted, he has been all eyes on Kermel Moten, curious what Mayweather can bring from a young fighter. Hopkins, who often speaks about the mental aspect of boxing, praised Moten's composure and energy. Kermel's mental strength and energy in that ring were remarkable. He stayed calm, made smart decisions, and executed his plan flawlessly. That's the mark of a true champion and a testament to Floyd's training. Hopkins analyzed. It looks like he's got the key to victory. Bouncing punches off the body of Mussolini. It is all Kermel Moten in the first Ooh, stuck in a beautiful His perspective just talked on the psychological edge that Moten possesses, a crucial factor in his success. And the praise didn't just come from Hopkins. Andre Ward, a former pound-for-pound -pound king and a mentor figure to many young boxers, was particularly emotional in his reaction. Ward has been a guiding figure for many fighters, offering technical advice and moral support. Watching Kermel tonight was like watching a young Floyd in the making. I've seen his growth, his hard work, and tonight it all came together. This is just the beginning for him. Ward said, visibly proud. His emotional response highlighted the personal connection and the journey they've shared. Come on, bro. That twist. Oh, that's it. Yeah, pull back that cheek. Pull back. Errol Spence Jr. was not also left behind. He provided a detailed breakdown of the fight. Spence, who has often been seen training with Moten, highlighted the tactical brilliance on display. Sugar. He doesn't get overexcited when he sees opening, when he sees success. He Kermel showed exceptional ring IQ tonight. He controlled the pace, dictated the terms, and executed his game plan perfectly. It's not just about power or speed. It's about making your opponent fight your fight, and Kermel did just that, Spence explained. His comments underscored the technical mastery that Moten exhibited, earning respect from a fellow tactician. Vasil Lomachenko was also in the ring, waiting for Shakur, and he didn't hold back on the results of this fight. Loma offered a concise yet impactful reaction. Lomachenko, who has been a measuring stick for many fighters, recognized Moton's talent. Kermel is a great fighter. He showed his class tonight. I look forward to seeing more from him, Lomachenko remarked. His succinct endorsement added a layer of credibility to Moten's performance, given Lomachenko's respected status in the boxing world. The night was filled with high praise and recognition, and as the conversations continued, it became clear that Kermel Moten's victory had undeniably stirred the pot in the boxing community. What did you think of his performance? Share your thoughts below and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for more updates. See you in the next one.